All right. Here we are with my MakerBot again. You can see it printing away and the, hear the lovely sounds of uh, the uh, stepper motors going to town. Makes a nice little song as it's doing a, one of the more complicated prints. Um, I've run off a bunch of things. Well, not a bunch. I've mostly had failures, but that's the interesting part. So, starting with the first thing that I printed off, this is the standard calibration cube. And you can see it's not terribly cube-like. So it turns out, when I ran this off, I did not do a very good job tightening down the Y-axis pulley, which fell off of the stepper motor. So the belt just started slipping and slipping and slipping, and I'm um, lucky it even came out this much. Um, I fixed that, and then I decided to do a slightly more difficult calibration, and this is a cylinder, theoretically, and you can see not all that cylindery. Uh, this was because the x-axis belt didn't have the right tension, so the edges got a little flattened. Ran off another, uh, came out better, but it's still not perfect. I decided that that is actually probably good enough for now, though. I, I just wanted to get in and, you know, print out some cool things. I uh, decided to take a crack at a little robot that I found on Thingiverse, and, uh, this one I aborted partway through because I, um... I didn't think about the fact that I needed to print out supports for the little arms on the robot, so it just started spilling all sorts of plastic thread all over the place because there was nothing to catch it. So I stopped this one part way through and just kind of ripped that off. Now, I'm printing out a more complex pattern here. This is going to be a little 3D knot. And you can see it's doing a pretty good job here, getting all of the uh, support that it needs and, and printing out uh, the nice shape. So take a picture of this when it's done, but this is my working MakerBot, pretty much uh, configured the way it's supposed to be. There'll be uh, little tweaks and, and stuff. I am, as you can see, still using the Step Scooter Mark VI since the 7 just came out a couple days ago, but uh, I plan to stick with this for a while. So, that is everything. Thank you much for watching.